We're hanging out by the pond. Luna's being a good girl. Is she working on her suntan with you? Yeah. I don't get tan, I just get whiter. Luna, pull her in the water. I mean, sure. It is freaking hot out today. And it's supposed to only get hotter like at this too. Point, I don't care if she pulls me into the water. You don't care? Hey, you're gonna make me hurt tiny toes. I know, you got tiny toad in your hand. Let me see. I just give him a little bit of water. He is tiny. He seemed to like water. He was probably There's water right there. I know, but he was probably very hot. Yeah, he was far away from it. So cute. I got some wind, so I'm gonna kite for a little bit. It's not very windy, like little chunks. Little, little tiny chunks. Little tiny toads of wind. Toad little toads of wind, yes. Luna, you can't pee on my wing. Oh, there's there's a little toad of wind. Luna, are you hot? Also, I brought some drone stuff because we're going to make a video since HNT mining is down and everything is so bad. With crypto right now, I took my antenna down and I'm going to put that on my drone. And we're going to make some silly drone videos with 915 megahertz freaking long ass antenna. Yeah. yeah. Luna, everyone says hi. You like my cup? It's sparkly. Do you, do you want some of this? You getting hot and wet? How you feeling? Are you feeling like you're gonna die a little bit? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, it's fucking hot as tits out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a tan. What is that? That's a, that's a wang. That's my wang. I have fun with your wang too. Yeah, sometimes I let you play with my wang. Yeah, sometimes your wang knocks me on my ass. <laughs> I didn't even check what the weather was today. Oh, there we go. Oh, I gotta, there's a tree in my way. I am now walking back with Luna to the house. She didn't want to get back in the van because it's hot. So she is walking home with me now. So don't mind all the extra sweat and hotness over here. Right now everybody's bitching about how prices went down on crypto and HNT has changed the network and nothing's working anymore. So since I'm not really earning anything anymore on, the, on that miner at the moment, I decided I'm just gonna stop it and we're gonna play around with the antenna. Um, I do have a little like 3 dBi antenna that came with it and a couple other ones that fit on my drone that are pretty much same frequency, but those are not gonna reach anything around out here because I don't have like, like this is a small town, so I'm the only one with a miner like that here. There are a couple towns over, but there's mountains in the background that block my signal from getting to them. We're gonna try and see what happens when we hook it up to my crossfire on my drone. And maybe it'll work, maybe it won't. Let's see. He's trying to hide. I see you. Falcor, are you gonna open my new package for me? What's in the box? Falcor's helping me open the box. He's going in, he's going in the package to check out what's going on in there. He wants to make sure it's okay. He's like, I open, don't worry. He is doing a fine job. He's like, I got this. I will open the rest of the way, don't worry. I got you guys. Just some shoes. Oh, they look nice. Oh, these are boots, nice. Are you very nice? Yeah, they're so <laughs> That's Sorry, that was a weird sneeze. Can you grab me my other shoes so I can show what they look like at the moment? Some sparkly innards. It'll match my... Inner aesthetic? No, the... Your dildo? Your thong? No. <laughs> the cup I was using. <laughs> anyway, these are my shoes currently, which mm -hmm. this doesn't look so bad till you look closer. Yeah. Hey, they worked for a good while. They're just kind of fucked at the moment. I guess they're done with. Yeah, my shoes kind of all explode at some point. Yeah, my other boots too that I use all the time, the whole back part of it came off. I've had to glue it like three separate times and go hiking like all the time with Luna. So it wears them down quick. Cause these were good. They lasted me the longest probably I've had out of all my shoes. I like, I I like the sparkles. Like so you can be hiddenly fabulous. Everybody already knows I'm fabulous. First of all. He's not ready for the action. Because this is too floppity. I mean, floppity doesn't really work with action. No. So, are you recording? Yes. 
People yesterday were making fun of my props. They're silly ass props that I got on like Halloween. Remember these with the little pumpkin stuffs on them? And people on the internet were saying that they're stupid and that they're lame. And, I like them. Okay, they, they Luna, we're trying to film a video. So I'm gonna admit that they're Luna! Don't touch. So people were saying that these were really stupid and to be kind of honest, like they kind of do suck because they're very brittle. Like they break easy and they bend pretty easy. So maybe it would be better on something that weighs a lot less. I like them. Not necessarily tiny, but this is too heavy for being something with these props. And I and last time, like I flew with these, I hit something not even that hard, and they just shattered. So they don't really last very well, but they do still fly. And I think with this, because of the weight, like if I do any kind of hard punch outs, that they they bend too much. And those dowel props I have, and the other ones, they I think they are HQ props, but they don't bend like this. They can take a lot more of a beating. So anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna put them on here today because my other ones are all fucked from crashing into things, and I'm I just want to see how well this does. We're gonna do something even more silly because I have this antenna, and we're gonna try it. We're gonna use this as our control antenna because it is no longer mining HNT. So by the power of Grayskull, we've got uh, Antoine Longson. That's gonna be his name. <laughs> there, oh, look, there's a little baby jumping spider on it. <gasps> I'm gonna put this right here for now. Wait, don't hurt the spider. No, I'm gonna put this right here for now. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna do a quick little test flight. But there's, a, there's like a few things that can go wrong with this, right? So from, from my thought, before I even do anything, I'm going to hold up the controller for you to see. And if this is red and blinking, and it's saying that it's overheating, then we're having an issue. But I had to, I had to put like a, an adapter here. And look at this long ass cable. So this is silly as fuck, but we're gonna try it and see what happens. What do you think's gonna happen? It can either overheat, I could go like past that tree right there, and then all of a sudden, the drone just cuts out because I lose signal. <laughs> I think it's gonna drop. Or I may make it to fucking Narnia and back. What do you think's gonna happen? Are we gonna go all the way down there? I think you're gonna get past like the graveyard and then drop. Past the graveyard and drop? Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna go to a flight to Mars. Elon said it was possible. <laughs> and the only way it's possible is with this antenna. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna go to Mars, we're gonna come back. Hell yeah, I wanna Wait, go to Mars. Do you have a in this thing, the show fly footage? <laughs> and normally, this is the little bitch antenna I use. <laughs> Look at this little bitch. This thing, you think this thing's good? That thing right there. Look at the difference in size. Which one do you think's gonna work better? <laughs> of course, this one, it's bigger, it's longer, it's- It's better. massive. This one goes from a 902 to 928 megahertz, okay? This was a 915. I mean, it could be a little girthier, but like, I'll yeah. I'll take what I can get. All right, let me put on my gogs. Gogs. That's what I call them now. I'm gonna have to cut this tree. It's kind of in the way. Yeah, but I kind of like it. I kind of like it because it gives us privacy right. in case we want to get naked. You what? I did cut it at one point. Yeah, well, that's a lot. You're my secondary eyes, okay? Okay, I'm gonna film the takeoff. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and hit record. So right now, I have. 58 dB, 59 dB. So that's not actually pretty good for what I normally have. And I'm on, well, I'm only on 10 milliwatts. So it's not even trying to give me full power yet. Maybe because I'm like really close. And this antenna is like a, it's more directional. So when you're flying with an antenna like this style, you want to be pointed directly at where like the drone's going to be because it's more of a focus. It doesn't really give like a good all around signal. The lower the dB, the better like all around it'll get, but it won't go as far. So with that one, we just need to keep the drone pointed in front of it and I should be fine. Let's yes. go for it. I'm recording. I, I'm recording. I think I've already lost signal. Yesterday when I was posting about these props and everything, I decided to like leave a bunch of stuff messed up on the drone and told people in the group that I posted if they're noobs to say what's wrong with the drone but if they're not noobs to only give wrong answers. But I forgot to put the props back on the right way. And somebody had called me out on it. They're like, you weren't actually trying to fly like that, were you? And I was like, no, like I'm like, I fucking knew what I was doing. And here I go forgetting to switch the props <laughs> and still going nowhere with them. It was scary. I'm switching them now, it should work. That looks better. 
sounds better too. It's not screaming like a freaking banshee. Bird up. Well, not that bird. This bird. You saw that? Yeah, blew right in front of my camera. All right, so right now it just says 65 on my SSI, whatever the hell it is. Let me go further out. I mean, it's still holding in the 47s, 46. I'm literally like right on the road, almost where the uh, fairgrounds are. You passed the fucking graveyard? Yep, I'm at the end of the graveyard right now. Okay. And I still have 40 on my signal for the control. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep flying over places where there's no people so that I don't have any problems if it crashes. Okay. And then it's also somewhere where we can recover it if it does crash. I'm like almost by the lake. I'm not even kidding, what I'm almost heck? at the pond. I still have 36 on my signal and my footage still looks really clear. Okay, now I dropped down to two bars, but it came back up to three. My signal for control is still stuck at 35, 34, which is more than enough to keep going. My signal says it's at one bars, but it's not dropping out yet. Maybe if, I, maybe if I go higher. Signal for footage is still at two bars. It went back up as I went higher. It actually worked. Holy shit, I'm surprised. Over those white buildings now, got full footage for signal and full footage or full control. So my video is really the only limiting factor at this point. I can seriously go to Narnia with this antenna. Coming back. Mm -hmm. Coming in hot. I hear you. Oh, I kind of see you. I have something I want to say. What? So when I saw this, I got really concerned because on the package, 
it said tattoo and it said like practice something battery oh, or yeah. something on the and i was like did he give me a fucking tattoo gun and i was like uh <laughs> uh i don't know what the fuck to do with that guess i'm gonna start tattooing myself don't get any ideas john because i did have tattoo stuff on my on my wish list so i was like oh no i really hope he's <laughs> Cause then I might, I might give you a little tattoo when you sleep. Look, this says do not pull. I'm pulling. I'm a fucking rebel. I'm fucking pulling. Don't pull it. I'm, I'm, fucking, <gasps> I'm pulling it. I don't, I don't listen to rules. You just littered. That's hey. bad for the environment. You're right. You're right. That was my bad. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah. Let's fucking fly. Don't. What did you think was gonna happen with this? They told you. <laughs> No, but after I started flying and stuff, you thought I was really just gonna go past the trees and it was gonna just die out? Yeah. Like fail safe or something? I thought it was just gonna like l l drop connection and it was gonna fall. You don't trust my return to home skills? I don't know how that works. I don't know how the, if it doesn't have connection, how it's is it? It's beta flight. Don't you think it would just come all the way back and just fucking land itself like it's supposed to? No, if it loses connection, I feel like it would just die. You need me to test it out right now and see what happens? We lose connection. <laughs> Don't do that. Remember that day that it was toilet bowling and I hit fail safe so that it would kill it and drop and it just kept going because I forgot that I set my fail safe to also return to home? Even though it was already in return to home, I was basically telling it to go into return to home. So it just kept fucking going around the lake, almost landing in the water until we chased it around with a net. I Eventually remember. it landed in the grass. So I felt just, like it was, I was afraid it was going to hit me. I was like trying to like keep after it, but like also not, not get, hit. get hit. Yeah, it was just kind of like going around in circles trying to come lower before it would land. Eventually it got low enough to the tall grass where it just got a bunch of grass in the props and, and landed. But it was over the lake for quite some time going around because we were flying over there and uh, over by the pond. But anyway, I'm surprised that that went as far as it did. Yeah. I, look, I understand. Yeah, it's a 915 megahertz antenna, but I thought for sure that just because, I don't know. It, like, well, it wasn't for this. But it's so, still the same frequency. Right. So it should work. But why I thought it might not is because the longer the cable, the more you lose on your amount of power that it's putting out. But I mean, I am using Crossfire, so I'm going to assume that if I just take off the antenna completely and have no antennas, that it's still probably going to make it out to the freaking lake. I don't know. That's what I think. But yeah, we'll maybe see. we'll see what other people think. <laughs> so this is my my drone. Everyone made fun of that can go to Narnia and back. And, uh, and props are still not exploded even after that flight with a 6S. I would have been really sad if I was mid-flight and that thing just shattered <laughs> in mid-air. And then I'm like, yep, that's why people were making fun of it. That's what I was thinking was going to happen. I'm sorry. <laughs> not because the drone, but just because we were using something that's not for the drone, I thought it would go wrong. Oh, between the antenna and then the shitty props? Nothing. I like them. The only reason why I say they're shitty is whatever they're, the material they're, they're made out of, if they just bump something while you're flying, like they shatter, they right. don't like the ones that I have that I normally fly, they bend and then you can usually bend them back a few times before you need to put new ones on. But with these, if they even so much as bump something, like usually they just shatter. And I hit the branch here and the leaves or whatever. And I, I thought for sure it was going down, but it didn't. And I don't see any like fuck ups on it. So, hey, people can shut the fuck up. Everybody's always got to be so negative. I meant like, like, yeah, maybe they're like bad quality, but I think they look cute. Yeah, I mean they got a, a interesting look to them because they're they're like Halloween they're and stuff. But, but yeah, anyway, it worked. All right, there you have it. I smashed it into a few things for you guys. These two somehow survived. 